this is Cinema. And this is Johannes. And you are watching Board Gaming Ramblings. And today we are playing Whistle Mountain, a new game from Scott Caputo, Luke Lorre, published by Bessier Games. It plays from two to four players in about 90 minutes. So in Whistle Mountain we are on a mountain. Getting whistles. Yeah. I do not know what the theme is here. Basically, we are building these scaffolds up on this mountain and the snow is melting. So this water is gonna flow upwards and kill all the dudes that live in this workshop because somehow we decided to build this workshop so that people had to live under this house. And then we're trying to build these scaffolds up here, build new machines, which are awesome, fantastic machines that we then can use to do better actions and promote our dudes to instead of standing in this workshop they had to stand in this very safe looking tower and the higher on this safe looking tower they stand the more points they were getting the theme here doesn't exist so let's just play the game yeah in this game this is basically a kind of worker placement game but you have workers over here but you don't use them for worker placement actions instead you use these airships which can be a hot air balloon or a blimp or a very big blimp i think it's called a dreadnought in this game you can place these on different worker placement spots that worker placements those worker placement spots are going to be very different throughout the game it's except uh, at least the ones out here you also have some worker placement spots around here different docks where you can use the same actions all the time so basically on your turn you can either place one of these either on a empty place here on the board or on a machine or you can place them in one of these slots to do different actions we're going to explain basically all the actions when we start playing the other thing you can do is to basically reset take in all of your workers or your airships and then you can do some building you can build up to three times you have to pay water for building more than once you can build these scaffolds and you can also build machines that you have you can also use gold to move workers from the workshop as you're paying them for work or you can spend double gold to save them from this whirlpool of water where they will be staying and having a nice spa but then they don't have to work but the workers that don't work will get you negative points at the end of the game they don't actually have a spa but they could just have that because of this I like thing. that you're saying that the guys get killed and sent to the spa, so the spa is heaven. No, they don't get killed, they don't get killed. They, oh, they yeah, get okay. dragged down the mountain and they will be down here in, in a spa. spa. Okay. Yeah. Nowhere in this game has there ever be killed, so okay, no yeah. killing of people in this game. Only making them go to the spa of the whirlpool. So basically what you are trying to do is to do that, is to get the scaffolds to get machines to maybe upgrade you are um, born here with different upgrades you can get cards which give you one of abilities and you're trying to build as high as you can every time somebody builds a machine over this danger line over the bridge then the snow melts and we'll add one more of these water tiles again no idea thematically why the snow only melts when you build up here maybe you Nobody use so knows. much warmth to build higher and then the snow melts i'm just making up the theme as we go and then if somebody is here they will go down to the worth pool of spa and you will have to try to get them out of there because those will be negative points and that's basically what you're going to try to do and when you have filled this up which means that there's no more workers here it can happen also before all of these uh, water spaces are filled up but most of the time that's what's going to happen mm. but if there's no more workers here you're going to end that round and then the player with the most points is going to be the winner you're going to get points throughout the game mostly and then there's some end of game scoring from these at the end of the game yes and that is a brief overview of how you play uh, we have already done basically the setup chosen a uh, different abilities so like starting abilities we can explain them when we use them the first time and we have set up taken two of the same scaffolding piece and placed one of them out on the board so now we're ready to start playing whistle mountain i'm the starting player mm -hmm. so i will start by placing one of my airships i think i will start by getting some more resources so here I will take the resources that my airship is adjacent to. So mm -hmm. I will have a gold, a... what is it called? Steel. Steel and a water. Yeah. Because these are different sizes. So this is two spaces, then the big one is three and this one is one. So if you only yeah. place this, you would have gotten a steel and a water. If you place the big one, there would be no change because mm. there isn't something up here. Yes. And now it's my turn. Yep. I think I'm going to go ahead and place over here. Yep. To get two water. And we can only have four of each resource at the end of our turn. Mm. Two water and a uh, ore. Yep. Or coal, it is not coal. ore. Coal. Yes. Now it's your turn. It's Baby, it's turn. coal outside. <laughs> the new Christmas song. <laughs> so I think 
I don't have any, I don't have enough resources to start building machines yet. So I think... And I have to remember this action because I always forget that action. Yeah. Which is a very good action to get this out of the way. And uh, because that's five negative points at the end. And we mm. never really gotten rid of them. Or all players, some players mm. pointing at you have gotten rid of their dudes there. But, nope. uh, not in the game? Nope. I think the first time maybe. No. Okay. No. I'm the same because you usually are good. I've never gotten all of my dudes out of the I just have to say, I just have to say, I won the last time we played, so just so you know, I, yeah. can, I can win in you games. You can win. The, you're able to, that is nice. It's something that happens from time to time. So, do I want some more resources? Resources. resources. Yeah, no, I think actually I'm going to go for some cards. Okay. So, I can have one card for free. I think I will go ahead and grab... Two cards for two resources. No, three, cards. three cards for two resources. That's bad because I am the mad scientist, so I can get an extra card every turn I get a card. So I wanted to do that, uh, but now I can't. Oh, okay. Um, and it's my turn? Yeah. Because you cannot spend a card the same round you nope. get it. I hope I remember all the cards. Okay, so I do. I have full in water. Full in water. You have, you have full in water. And I need whistles here. There's no mm. way to get whistles now, which is kind of hard. Yeah. So there's no way to get many of these scaffolds yeah. at the same time because Our there's no resources here that gives me, or no um, cards basically, which gives nope. me any. So I think I am going to go over here and grab yeah. a machine for two coal. That is nice. Um, so which one do you want? But you don't have coal. So if there's nope. anything else I want to do first, I should do that first. And I think maybe there is. Because mm -hmm. you don't have two coal and you don't have any whistles, so there's no way for you of stopping me there. Unless I have a cool card. Oh, that is true. You can get things from that and you just go and destroy my life. Which is something you usually do. I'm good at destroying kind of lives. Oh, uh, you obviously are. If I don't do it, you are going to have that card. The card that gives you something. I don't remember what all the cards do, so no, they're because I I don't really have I don't I think I've not played with many cards. That's why I chose this. And then I go for not cards. Um Is it super important for me? No, I actually think I am gonna go uh, over here and just save a dude. Oh well, that's nice. Where do you want to put him? I think I am You can put him on put and him. In empty spaces on the scaffold, so where there's no resources or Airships. I'm gonna place him down here, basically. That is nice. There can never be machines on this Yeah, scaffolds. I'm just saying. And then it's your turn. Yeah, I don't have a card with that, so that yes! is fine. Yes! No! Okay, happy, so... happy, happy. I am super happy. You are good for you. Nice. Okay, so I will... Hmm. I can just play one card mm -hmm. on my turn so I have to like see if there's something that I want to do I don't think so no is there huh I don't have any machines right now and I'm I'm in no position to get any right now so I think I think I will go over here yeah, that sounds good and just take one water and one coal mm -hmm. to be ready to get a machine, machine later. Yeah. Then you're done. Yeah. Then I am gonna go and grab that machine. Oh no. So I'm gonna pay. Oh two. wait, I wanted to pay, play a card first. Too Sorry. late. Because now I, it's my turn. Because you can only play one card each turn. I wanna play this and get two more cards. Okay, so I am the card man, you have all the cards. So I am going to spend two coal to grab a machine. So I can either get... I think I'm going to go for for actual getting resources. Yeah. So then you can refill that. Yep. Wet gold. Okay. Wet gold. I like so those. Shiny coal. Like I like it. It's shiny coal. Yeah. Black pointer. Shiny pointer. So it makes sense. I yeah. haven't really noticed that before. It makes so sense with the theme. It's so thematic. No, no, I mean the building. It's it's fun that they actually made some okay, fun. So names. I have no. Um, oh, I'm saying workers all the time. I have no airships. Airships yep. left. I have to take them back. Mm -hmm. I don't know why this is here. This should be there. Yeah, like this, and then I'm doing the forge action, so I can build 
something. You only have one scaffold, so you yeah, can build I can, that for free. I think I will use a card to get me another scaffold. Uh -huh. I think I will... Oh, but you're blocking that space. That would be good build, build, building there. They also get points for building scaffolds, which you will soon understand how. Yeah. I think I will take this. Uh -huh. And I think I will place it here. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. Like that. That gives you one, two, three points, because basically you get a point for each yes. side that um, touches something else. So you get three of these three nice points. victory points. And stars! It's kind of like in suburbia. And Are I... there stars in suburbia as well? There's stars somewhere. I don't think it's in suburbia. They have these stars mm. somewhere. Oh, it's mm. a, I don't remember, but there are some There's stars somewhere. There's squares in suburbia, aren't there? Because the people that is are true, points. That's true, that's true. I just feel the like I've seen... The people are points. The people okay. are points. I it's could now. Company. I could now spend uh, water to yep. build more, but I... I it's su not super important for me to build this yet, mm -hmm. so I'm going to not do that. Yep. And then I will use a gold mm -hmm. to move... A dude. This dude. Oh, it was hard grabbing him. Eep. I will place him next to you, I think. No, oh, you can do that now. That probably isn't good. No, I can get this too if I get sent. Of course, in yeah. Yeah, okay, get. Okay, I'm I'm done. Okay, so that's not good. You're trying to leech on me there. I'm trying to leech on you. So now I would be happy if I had this piece instead, which hmm. I could have placed here. I didn't have to build a building where you are. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. So I'm helping you now, which is not good. But I have to, to take in my airships. Yep. So I'm gonna do that. And I'm gonna build, and I think I am gonna build this, or because you just built that space, so do I need to build that? I can't have any more water, so it's kind of stupid not to use some water. Thing is though, I would have liked to build it here. Can you just scooch this one oh, in this yeah. space? Oh yeah, no problem. Of course not. So now I'm helping you, like I'm giving you basically five points for free. Hmm. Giving you more points than I'm getting myself. Yeah. But this is a free build action, which is pretty yeah, neat. Yeah, yeah, it's pretty neat that too. So, so I think I'm just going to build this here. Yeah, Am you I? want three points for or that. I'm just going to build it over here. That maybe. also has your three points. Yeah, I'm going to do that. Three points. Three points for you. Thank you. I'm just going to do that. Uh, do I want to build it there? I think so, yeah. Three points there. And then I'm going to pay a water. To do another build action. To build this. I'm going to build it over here. Do I'm you want to move a dude pay first? Pay a gold to move him over here. That sounds good. And I'm going to build it over here. Oh, that's nice. How this works now is that these guys get promoted. Yeah. So I'm the player who activated, so I go away first. So if there was only one thing here, I would get it. We'll get it, yeah. But you will also now get this. Whee. And this will go over here. I will get this. So these aren't worth any points at the end of the game. This is worth one, but basically these will net us five points. So that mm -hmm. is better than the other one. But this gave me a free build. So it's still out. It's still not negative points, which mm -hmm. is like the, the biggest thing. Oh, yeah. And that is my action. Yes. Do I want to use this now? I want to build the no, I don't. <laughs> so now it's kind of hard to get uh, scaffolds because there's no way of getting whistles. So oh far. yeah. Okay, so I I think I'm gonna start by. Isn't that the way that I want it to be? That's the way. Uh huh. Uh huh. I like it. Uh huh. Uh huh. Actually, I can use that. Yes, you can. That would be nice, wouldn't it? Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> nope. Not gonna do that. Huh. Something you need to do though. Yeah. I was just like, huh. You were just. Oh, and I want to have five points for that. Oh yeah, you. That can. would be nice. Yes. Of course. Or else that it will be. That sounds good. It's good to have. have I would have done that. And you probably want to start building some upgrades yeah, that because is that is your starting at, ability. Because I don't have the power to do that yet. I've got the power. You don't have any coal and you don't have any cards. So I'm pretty safe that you're not going to do any... Shenanigans. Shenanigans. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so I want to place my big airship 
over here. Uh huh, the same place. Yeah, just Why the leeching big one? Um, because if I wanted to place on this oh, yeah. later, Makes sense. my big airship can't go on there. So I want to get one water. Now we're one... going to start to be able to get some of these uh, big. Uh, yeah. Big machines. Big machines. It's my turn. Yeah. I'm going to do this pretty neat placement over here. Oh. Which then gives me <laughs> two gold and two coal. Yeah, that's nice. Because I activate the machine I'm on, and I'm also activating the adjacent spaces. Yeah. Oh, it's me? Yes. Yeah, so I'm going to place... Ooh. Um, hmm. I'm going to place over here, I think. Mm -hmm. With two coal, and I, I want to have the wet gold. Cool. My turn? Yeah. I am gonna go and grab some cards. That sounds like I'm gonna likely. spend two water, I think. Yeah, I'm gonna spend two water to grab three cards, and at the end of my turn, I get a fourth one because I am the mad scientist. <laughs> so I don't even know what these cards do because I have never played with any of these cards. Oh, oh. But that one I remember. Do you remember? Yes, I remember that. That one is cool. There's uh, no way cool. to get whistles. And that it's is not. a little... And this needs whistles and this needs whistles. Yeah. Okay, so me? Yeah. It's my last airship. And he's going over there. To grab an upgrade. Yeah, and I have three of these. So you're going to buy this? I'm going to buy this. And it can I can pay whistles for this later. To if get more whistles upgrades. will, Start will exist. Soon. And this is very interesting because this actually changed up the game quite a bit that mm, no yeah. whistles are available. Yeah, absolutely. Because it's so much harder to get these. Okay, so then I can activate, because this is my ability, when I got that upgrade, I can activate, activate a, a, a machine. Uh, so so I will activate the only, the only one machine available. And I'm done. So no, my problem is that I'm not, I'm going to end up having nothing oh, to wait, build. Wait, sorry, uh, I'm just looking for... A piece. Okay, I will try this piece. I have another card. Oh, I would like those cards. I'm done. Yes. It's really hard now to get the resources because we're not getting the um, we're not getting uh, the whistles. Mm, yeah. Here, there's a whistle. I like the cards. The first time we played, we didn't know that we could play just one in a round, so we had this. No, but we didn't do it. We were we were combos. asking about it, and, oh, we, yeah, didn't, and yeah. we did not end up doing it wrong. Absolutely. Yeah, one person's. One... I was I was planning towards a Cheating. really yeah. cool combo that I oh, wasn't allowed to do. Okay, so it was too bad, but I am a bit unsure how I will go about oh, doing no. this. Because this is very bad, because I have no way of getting... It sounds bad going here and getting one scaffold, but I do need that scaffold. But then again... Or else I'll just take back my things and not do anything. Mm. And you have the possibility to build two scaffolds and a machine. But that is better. I'm just talking to myself, yeah, yeah. trying to plan ahead. But basically, the thing is... I could have built a big machine instead of taking that. Oh yeah, oh, I had to refill this. Oh yeah. What is that? Oh, you get a oh. resource every time you place hmm. a <laughs> machine. Can't afford that. This is hard, like, okay, I'm just gonna, hmm. This is hard now. I do not know how, I do not know how to get this done. Because I don't have the things I need. Sorry, I do not, just, just, I have no idea what's going on now. now. I know, I, I know what's going on, but I'm just having trouble. And just to clarify, you can take in all of your airships before you've placed all three of them. Oh yeah. Yeah. So you can even do it when you have zero. Yeah, absolutely. So that is always a possibility. It's just I'm just gonna grab some resources basically because oh, yeah. I'm not gonna be able to, to do anything good. Mm -hmm. So I'm just gonna 
basically do a very boring reset. Okay, so it's my reset. Yes. I'm going to your turn? grab my airships back. Mm -hmm. And I want to build. And I really wanted to build there, mm -hmm. but as I see now, it's more efficient if I try to build upwards yep. so that I, I can get some of these cool bonuses and also get some more points for my actual dudes. Points are good. Points I heard good for things my actual about good. dudes. So I will, I think, just place... Oh, I had a thought in my brain. Sorry, can I just play a card? Of course. Because you haven't really, really oh, done I anything haven't yet, done anything. right? Yeah. So I, I'm going to play this card, which makes I will discard cards. Yeah. So I am going to discard this and I will draw two more cards. Yeah, of course. Draw two more and then it's you. So I can place there and that will be very good for me, will it? I will, or I can do that. That is not good enough. Okay, so I'll do like that. I will place this one here. Uh -huh. That just gives me one point. One point. And I will place this one there. This gives you and four points. So five in yep. total. And I've used one water to do that. I'm using a second water. To do your so... last bill because you can only do three max. Yeah, I want to use a gold to move a dude first. Yep. And I want to play my card that says I can use another gold to mm -hmm. move another dude. Like that. Yep. Because I want these two bonuses. Oh, that is amazing. And then I've already used the water that Cheating. I need. Boop. Over there. So he so you get promoted. nine points from that. That is promoted. amazing. Everyone and then gets six. promoted. So you get six points for building that building. And these lets me activate some machines later. Yeah. So, oh, I could have rescued one now, actually, and put him in the five point. Uh, yeah, I think I'll do that. Yeah, so there was room for that. Yeah. Yes. Just to have that one out of the way. That is a very good move. Yep. That is a better move than any move I'm going to do, because I'm going to reset and do nothing, which is I'm just horrible. I'm only one card left now. They're very <laughs> useful, I feel like. Yeah. Oh wow, this is horrible. Okay, so I'm gonna reset and do nothing. It sounds like a very good action. It was hard getting things now, and I'm just gonna play this to take a coal and a gold. A coal and a gold. And do I want to take a gold and a water? No, I'm gonna take a coal and a gold. You have a lot of resources now. Um, that is the only thing I have, so now it's your turn. Hmm, so... I think so if I place it hmm. Hmm. I want some whistles and then you have to grab this yeah hmm Oh, yeah, I can grab that. <laughs> it has whistles on it, so yeah. Okay. Oh, yeah, that would be nice. The chances that we're going to build a machine over it any second is big, though. Okay, so I think that that I'm going to use hard. my card. Its name is Cherry. That means that every roll that I have empty, I can fill up with one. Yes. That means that yeah. I get... Oh, actual whistle. An actual whistle. That's I didn't crazy. get like maximum out of that, but I feel like it's gonna be hard to empty all your resources. Yeah, that is my thought. So I think I will go over there mm -hmm. and grab myself. I'm going to use my one whistle yep. to grab one here and. I can grab one L as well. And you're done? I'm done. Awesome. I uh, I, I can 
It's a really big problem now because I can go and build some buildings over and build some machines over here, but that's not really good. So that is just basically Oh yeah, horrible. because you don't have a scaffold either. Or I have it now, but like two seconds ago I didn't. Because you are a horrible person. I don't think that <laughs> I'm gonna play that and oh, you, hopefully... you have scaffolds? That makes you a horrible person. Uh, that. And then I have to place something. Oh, you have enough resources for some machine right now. Yeah, for a small machine, but I don't yeah. have any scaffolds. <laughs> so I am gonna go. You can get one scaffold, but and, and that's not that bad. But there. Yeah. And I'm going to grab a steel and a gold and a water. A water. Boom. 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 So I have resources. Good for you. And I'm done. Yep. Oh, I got cards. So I get another card. Nice. Because I want to... I'm just playing out what the best placement of this dreadnought is. I can place him here. Mm, don't place him. That's the best thing. Oh, okay. Never mind. <laughs> Um, I can place them here. That mm -hmm. lets me two gold and two water and one coal. Yeah, let's do that. Two water. What did I say? Two water. Two gold mm -hmm. and one coal. I always struggle to see like best placement on this. Yeah, but it's scaffold. interesting. I like how it, it changes up. Because I could have put my too long ship. Too long ship. <laughs> on top of a machine as well. But I, I don't do that. Mm -hmm. I'm done. I'm done. I'm going to start by playing treasure chest. Yeah. Getting two whistles. Oh, that is very nice right now. Yeah, because I need to get some scaffolds. scaffolds yeah. Or else the game is going to be very hard. So I am going to... Take some scaffolds. How did you guess that? That's Just crazy. Like guessing wildly right now. I'm gonna go here and I'm gonna pay both my whistles, I think. Those are also, these are also jokers or wild resources. Oh, yeah. But no, I really need to, to get some actual scaffolds. Scaffolds. Okay, is there any way okay. I can do that? I am gonna hmm. We will see. I'm gonna grab this. Yeah. And I'm gonna grab this. Mm-hmm. 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 I'm just making sound I'm gonna grab this. Oh. Oh, Whoa. cool. That's a good okay. sound effect. Yeah, I'm okay. just... I'm and, trying to vary it a little. And that's my turn. That's your turn. Okay. So, I would like to grab a machine right now so that mm -hmm. I can actually build it this turn. But then again... I really want to have that extractor so that the scaffolds that I build now actually net me something. Oh yeah, that's yeah. good. So I think I'm going to use tree gold yeah. to get that. Then you get to activate a machine. Yes, I do. And then I will activate this yeah. shiny coal. And you're done? I'm done. It's not that interesting activating small machines. I am gonna do something. I'm starting my sentence before I really know what I'm gonna do. I had a plan, but I'm just a bit unsure if I can do it. Oh, you had a plan. Oh, scary. <laughs> this scary plan I have. Scary plan. Oh yeah, I am gonna do that. <gasps> I am gonna go here. Ah, that's cool. And I'm gonna play three and two. And I'm going to grab the trophy nice. room. Oh, that's a nice machine. And then I'm also going to uh, play the upgrade market card. Ah, nice. And I'm going to play pay a gold and a water to get the winner's circle. Oh, not happy about that. That is super nice. So You're every time I so promote something, I will get to... Yeah, but they also need to use them. And then... Um, oh, poor you. You need to use them or else you'll get a point for them. Oh, what a... Situation. You don't have any machines, right? No, I don't. And you don't. don't have any cards. Nope. Okay, so then I am going to spend this. Yeah. To uh, uh, build a scaffold. Okay. And I'm going to build it here. Yeah. That's going to give me one, two, three, four points. Nice. Can I have four points, please? Can you give me a one? 
I can. Give me five. <laughs> okay. Okay. I'm the most funny person ever. Are you done? I'm done. Done. Okay, so I have to get my airships back. How are you taking two more dudes from than me? Because I had a card. Oh, when I took in last time, I forgot just to move a dude. Are you? You could move, but did you have gold for that? Oh yeah, absolutely. I, I had yeah. all the resources in the world. Do you want to do that now? That yeah, but what has been built after that? Only this basically, because you built this before I did that. Ha. <sighs> That is horrible. I forgot yeah. it basically. I, I because I didn't build anything, so I didn't think yeah, about it. Yeah, it's okay it. if you want to put something but else. But I don't know if it's good or no, not. No, that is a question. So I will not do that. Okay. So it's me, mm -hmm. and I want to build a scaffold. Yep. So I want to build it. Hmm. That's one, two, three, four, five, six. Let's see, it's here. one, two, three, four, five, yep. And if I put it here, it's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, right? You can't place it here. That yeah. doesn't work, you can place it there. I have this as well. Oh yeah, that one's gonna be one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, that's okay. correct. So I'm placing it there. Yep, seven points. Seven points. And do you Gryffindor. wanna be smarter than me and actually move a dude? Yeah, I can. That sounded good. That is very horrible of me. Oh, I have my points up here. Uh, and I also will choose to take a gold from that scaffold. Oh yeah, that's true. That's good. And I will use one of that gold. I think I will stick to just one yet. And but I have okay. But it's yeah. I'm placing it here. Yep. Yeah. You're done. Oh yeah, I'm done. I'm gonna take this in. Is that oh, the best it's very that I hard, do. stupid for me to have done that. Yeah, I'm not super happy, but it's fine. But no, I basically I chose the wrong pieces, so I cannot build my big thing. Oh. I think I can, but it's gonna be down here, which is not good. Oh yeah. Because if I do this, because I need no, yeah, I can just do that. Yeah. Yes, that's what I'm gonna do. So I'm gonna pay the two water because I'm gonna build three things. Yes. So I'm going to place this for three points. Yeah. And this for then one, two, three more. So six so points. Six in total. Six points. And then I am going to use this. Oh, to save a guy. To move this over here. You want to gold as well? I'm going to spend. No, I'm going to forget that again. And place that over here. Yep. And then I'm going to build this. Yep. Nice. So this just goes over here. Boom. Ah, so yeah, side face. And this goes over here and gives me this. I also yeah. get two more and two more, so I get four more. Oh, that is an... yeah. Because that's two... that is very powerful. I... I... I think it has to... That's pretty good. It has to be right, right? Yeah, yeah. This says every time you promote. So that is very, very cheap. And very good. But it's a very few points for it. Okay. Oh yeah, that is a thing. And but that is a lot of I points. I will get that 10 points, please. 10 points, please. Oh, sorry. Here you go. And then I'm going to spend a secret door to move him up here. Oh, because you this. didn't play a card this turn? No, no I didn't. didn't. So I'm going to grab that. Nice. And I did spend one of these, so I cannot spend any more. That is very good. And that is good my turn. Good for you. I think you just like doubled like your last. You made, I don't know. My words are failing me. Your turn now. And then know. some water comes on. Oh, because yeah. I'm building you over the bridge. Above the water. So the first water tile is coming here. Uh, and now this first machine doesn't first work anymore. Bridge. Okay, so I still need some scaffolding. Yeah, it was yeah. hard getting it now. It we need to refill oh, this. Yeah. Really, really need some scaffolding, I think. I will just like start by doing this. What was that? By doing this. Uh, activating a machine. And I had two identical. Yeah. I will activate trophy room. Mm -hmm. 
to use my gold to take a ribbon. Cool. Just to see if I get lucky and it's a whistle on it. That would be nice. No, it's not. But it's a little machine. It's a small machine, yeah. It's, it's a, a machine. small machine. So you want to do something else? Hmm. I think that... I'm going to do it like this. Hmm. That would be quite nice, wouldn't it? I think that... Hmm... Oh, I want to place... I, I need some resources, maybe. I... Why do I need resources? To build better machines. Yeah. Hmm. But I don't want to build better machines. Hmm. Okay, well, let's just buy the extension over here. Yeah, that's a cool one. Mm, but then I can activate a machine. I didn't know that. So, you didn't know? No, I I used my gold to then activate this yeah. when I could have done it now. So that sucks a little, yeah. but it's okay. You can't basically take it back. That's going to be... Huh? No, can't take no it back. I can't. And then I will then activate this. Yep. Yeah. And get a water, get and a gold. water and a gold. And you're done. And I'm done. I think I need some resources, so I could do that. So let's see. I am gonna, I am gonna spend my secret door to go up here. Oh, you Grab stupid! This. I didn't call you stupid. You did. I did. I am then. I can also use one of these. That is Just a really good move. Any upgrades I want? Oh yeah. Spending uh, whistles to points. That sounds good right now. Mm. All of these are really bad now because I don't want to spend whistles or anything. And I don't have anyone down here so far. So this is bad. But there are points basically. So I can change this into seven points right now. Yeah. Which is good. But you're not probably going to buy something you for whistles. You are... What am I? You just have so many. But could we remove those that you have used? Yes. Let's do that. So I only have seven of them now. <laughs> that is so many. It is. You managed to snag all of these three and get yeah. two and get two more. Yes. That is insane. It is. It's pretty cool. Uh, yeah, I it, think it's I, actually pretty cool. I think I need some resources. So I'm going to go for some oh, yeah. resources. But the question is, what kind of resources do I want? Because <laughs> I need... No, do I, I want, want a airship that goes like this. <laughs> that's cool. I need that's the expansion. Uh, I am gonna go here, I think, grab two water, a steel, and a coal. And I've used a card, and I've used one of these. Did I use one of these? No, I didn't. I don't know. I did not use one. I was thinking I of using not. this, but I did not use it. So I'm just gonna think, I have, I have, I'm gonna use one every turn, so I have to think about which one I want to use. Points. So... Oh. Maybe a whistle. Is there a small machine I want? Mm. Wet iron. I like those names. I haven't seen them before. Uh, I think I'm just going to grab a small machine. Yeah. I'm going to grab the, uh, the shiny pointer, I think. Shiny pointer. Or am I going to grab something oh. else? No, I'm happy with that. Are you happy? No, not happy, but I'm going to do that. You better be. Why? Because it took the one that I... No, I'm just kidding. Double iron. Double iron yeah. all the way Sorry. across the yeah. sky. My bad. Okay, so I still have one here. That is negative five points. Negative five. <laughs> okay, so I think... Why are you laughing? I'm so funny. Yeah, that is why. I'm going to place this over here. Boom! Am I not? Yeah. And I'm Are you going just going to leak on, leech on my uh, trophy try strategy? Oh, yeah. I have to try to keep up. Keep up, dude. But then if I use my gold on that... Oh, it's going to be fine. Yeah. Isn't it? Yeah. No problem. Okay, I will get another ribbon. 
trying to Ooh, just... It's a trophy. Oh, ah, yay! It's a whistle! It's a... On the mountain. What did you say? It's a wiggle? It's a whistle. It's a whistle. I will definitely take the whistle. Oh, right you're just I don't... Do you, can you spend them at once? Like, it's the same as cards? I don't know. I'm guessing it is. Oh. Oh, it's okay. Because I we can can't use it. cards the same round, time. so I'm it's guessing... no problem. I will the then same. take... A an, small machine. A small machine instead. And which one do I want? I think... You have many points there. That's 8, 14... What was that? 9 points for the round? 6, 8? 8. 24 points, yeah. Mm. You are in the lead with those. <laughs> I think that I will take the black point ruby then. Okay, and then it's me. It's you. I am gonna go and grab some cards. So mm. I think, but I can't use the cards the same round, so I definitely have to get the cards now. Yeah. So I'm gonna spend a steel and a coal to grab three. Yeah. Um, yeah, that is cool. I can't use them now. So I'm not gonna spend a card, which is bad, but I am gonna spend one of these. And I am gonna grab a scaffolding. Yep. Which one do you want? I want this. And then at the end of the turn, I'm going to get this. And then it's your turn. Okay. So I have my last airship. It's so, so much tighter. We play this with three and four. Mm -hmm. It's so much tighter with three and four. This seems like a walk in the park in comparison. Really. Um, I'm going to go over there and mm -hmm. use my, what's it called, award? A trophy. Trophy. A ribbon trophy award, I don't know. Uh, as a whistle to take some scaffolding, I want, I, I'm just going to grab a T and an L so that I have a little different shapes to work with. Mm -hmm. And I could have gotten a bigger machine, I see that now, but I, my didn't, turn? Thought, uh, I didn't think that I would. Get so many scaffoldings. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's you. Yeah, it's me. Yeah, it's you. I am gonna. <laughs> hmm. Yeah, I'm gonna place this here. Yeah. So I get a water and a gold. Mm -hmm. And a coal. Yep. And I'm gonna spend the gold from the trophy because I need more trophies. I hope that you don't get to play them all before the game ends. That's just <laughs> four more <laughs> points. And that's just four more. I'm just points. gonna grab six points. Yep. So I can give you four. No, I can't. So six points it is. Six points. There you go. Thank you. And then it's you. Yep. So I wanna. You have to take in? Oh, yeah. I do. I do. I do. I do. I do. Hmm. Okay, so I'm going to build something. Obviously. Yeah. Do I want to rush up to that scaffold? Is my, my question. I can do that if I just place this here for one mm -hmm. and I can't need two dudes. That would be really nice, but I can't. Shoot. Agony of choice. But it's very easy for you to get on the top of there then. Because you can build something now. You're just going to build your oh that makes me a little angry. Just a little. Just a little bit. Okay. Can I sorry that this takes a little time? I just need to work this out. We can work it yeah, out. Yeah, 
We can work it out. No, that doesn't work at all. Can I do it this way? Yeah, I can do it this way. Yeah. So you're going to place that. those two. So that's going to be one, two, three points. Yeah. And then the other and one is going to be one, two, three more points. So that's yeah. six points. And I will get two whistles. whistles that is that. pretty good. I'm sad I didn't take that one. Um, six, wait, six, six points, points yeah. yeah. And you're placing a machine as well? Yeah, so that that's is seven. seven. What, that's so 13, 13 points. in total. Yeah. So I will just take 15 and give two back. And I will place... Oh, no, you place it wrong. Here. I will place a dude here. And I will place the machine here. And since I have the extension, oh, he gets promoted in there. That Whee! is nice. And That's I some sneaky stuff. One. Uh, and some water I across. used two water yep. to do that. And I also had to use one of my whistles to get him in there because I needed to, to move him. Oh, yeah, because we didn't have any gold. Yeah. Okay, but you are way ahead of me here, which is horrible. I'm just, just wondering if I should... Nope, I'm doing that. Yeah. And you need to uh, play some water. Yeah, I need to do that. And then this comes back, so I don't have to reset if I don't want to. And you don't have any buildings and don't have any cards, right? Uh, no, I don't. So I could now place this before doing something more. Okay, so now I'm gonna go ahead and actually use some cards. Okay. Um, or cards, I can't use more. <laughs> uh, I am gonna place this, I think. And I'm gonna get a whistle. A whistle. So I can go in and grab a couple of scaffolds. Nice, do you want to use that whistle when you're Yes, that's scaffolds. kind of the point. So I'm gonna grab two. So my question now is, but there's no way I can move more than one dude, which is the bad thing. And if I do my plan now, I'm gonna be in a bad position, dude. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, I can actually do that. Is that actually worth it somehow? I think it is. Okay. So I am going to grab two. And... Hmm. That's a cool thing. I'm gonna grab two, so I'm gonna grab. Let's see if I build this. So I'm gonna grab this. And I'm gonna grab this. Yeah. Oh, you only got. And oh, I'm gonna the same pieces. play this card. Yeah. To spend two to take a small building. So nice. I'm gonna grab that one that gives me the most points. Wet iron. Wet iron. Double pointer. And then I am done. I hope my plan works out. Mm, oh, you have a plan. That is dangerous. Hmm. Oh, no, it doesn't work out. Yay. Oh, yeah, it might. No. Er. Let's see. Let's see. No, it doesn't work out. I think it doesn't work out. Hmm. Sad face. Hmm. Huh. I'm just like. We have built this like one tower just yeah. to get up here in the tower. What do I want to do now? It's very safe scaffolding this. Very, like, yeah, absolutely. I would not be happy if this was where I lived. Aha, uh -huh. I think. And it's very, and like, it doesn't make sense that they're building these machines just to get them flooded. <laughs> I would, if I was like the superior of this 
project, I would say, let's build it somewhere else. And this and this and this. Good for me. So I think I will go over here mm -hmm. and just take a whistle. Yep. And, and a point and a... And a call and a point. And it's my turn. But that was not very useful. My turn? Yeah. I'm gonna grab my dude. Oh. Um, well, you have two machines. Are you going to build them all at once? No, I... Uh, that would be awesome. I can, but I'm just, is it worth it? Yeah, maybe it is. Because if I do, then my plan works. But you can only, oh yeah, I don't know what cards you have, but so if you don't um, get your dudes up there, it's not of no I'm use. I'm going to build this. Yep. It's going to give me three points. Three points. Are you going to... No, just change for a five. Yeah. Oh. I... Give me a five. Huh. It's the same joke from earlier. Better now, nice. because it actually made sense. Yes. And then I am gonna build. I'm gonna spend two water because I'm gonna build two things more. Yeah. So I'm gonna build this over here. Yep. For six points. For six points. Give me six. I'm the most funny person in the world. And then water comes. Oh, yeah. And it faults my dude. Oh, no. Poor guy. You're not gonna move him before he does? No, because I'm gonna use this. Oh, nice. To move him, and I'm gonna use another one to move the other one. Up here? Yeah. And then I'm gonna use my last build to build this here. Nice. That gives me seven points seven and two points. trophies. Seven points and two trophies. You are insane. I am not insane. You have a lot more points than me, I feel like. Because you have... I've built two small machines and you've built like three small and a big. A big. Uh, a big. Hmm. So... Um... And I have to use one of these, so I am going to use this mm -hmm. to get a card. And nice. then I get two cards. Nice, so good for you. now it's your turn. Okay. I have two more airships left. That's the information that I've got right now. I have the opportunity to build a big scaffolding. A big scaffolding. Oh, uh, a big sorry, machine big to grab machine. a big machine. Yeah. yeah. Do I want to do that? Is my question? What does that mean? It means that you pay a coal and you move a dude. But what does that mean? That means that every oh, you get twelve points and all of these go on down. No. Oh, so if he was like near the water, I would guess he goes into the water. Yeah. Okay. Hmm. I will... I will go over... Hmm... Is that not that good, is it? Good, good! No, I wanna go over here. Mm. <laughs> it doesn't really matter. No, it Nothing doesn't. really matters. Uh -huh. I want to build a big machine, don't I? Yeah. Probably. You're not going to build it, you're going to take a big machine, yeah? Yes. That sounds good. I will. Yeah, I'm not going to build it. I hope you, your plan is to build it or else it will be a very bad move. No. <laughs> I'm not just at gonna, all. I'm not going to build it, I'm just going to... I'm going to take the factory, I think. Yep. Yeah. Is that what I want to do? And then refill. I have no resources. <laughs> Not me either. Oh, yeah. And you're done? Yep. Yeah, I'm gonna go and place myself over here. Yeah, that was my me two points other opportunity. And one of oh, each sorry. resource in st uh, except for a whistle. Two of these, right? Yep. Two of these point thing is. Oh. Oh! No! And I am gonna play this. Yep. 
to activate the same I am on, which gives oh, me a call nice. and a point. So I'm just going to change for a 10. Four. Oh, okay, yeah. So I'm going to give you 9. Get a 10. Oh, you have an insane amount of points. Remember that you have Look quite a few this. points on the... Look at this. And it's you have so... two tens or? No, no, it's ten a, five. a five. Yeah. Oh. And uh, yeah, I played a card and I can also play one of these. Oh, even more points. So I think I'm just going to play this for six points. Yep. That sound is nice. Six points. Yep. Yep. There you go. Thank you. That's you, or do you want to do yes, something else? I can't do anything else. I place a thing, and I did a thing, yeah. and I place a thing, and I did a thing. Yeah. That's how soon I would tell her You've turn. You've already done like my things that you should. I yeah, think. I'm just cheating. Your turn. I can do that. That is better. Better is good. Better is good. Then I can do this. Nope. I don't want to do that. I want to do this instead. Good job. Me. I want to take some scaffolding, I think. Just all the scaffolding in the world. Just give me three scaffolding. I'm going to take oh, one three. of those. You had two whistles. And choo choo. Okay. It's the sound the whistle makes. And one of those. And let's do another of these pieces. Good. Good for me. Hmm. That is my turn, isn't it? Yeah, it is. Okay. Oh, I can under take another scaffolding. Maybe I should do that. Hmm. No, oh, I can wait. I can wait, it's okay. And my turn now, I am very unsure. Because you are now... But is it even possible for you to build that big one up there now with one setback? It's not, is it? Hmm? Oh yeah, it is. Uh, it is. Yeah, because that that yep. piece right there. No. But I will just get one dude under it, so it's not that good. I will feel that's pretty good. Hmm. I feel that's pretty good. Oh yeah, maybe. It's ten points. That is pretty good. It's very good. So you will do that. I did not do that scaffolding. Now I should have waited. Hmm. Hmm. It's a lot of interesting decisions. Because this is not very good, I can do this, for example. I do that, that, no place there. Uh, I can do that, that, so I can do this. I am going to place this Oh over. wait, we've placed one few, too few water. It's four machines over the bridge. And we should have done one more oh, water. Oh, what did that happen? Because you... Oh, I placed two, yeah. Placed that's, that's two true. and I forgot they placed the other water. Yeah, yeah, so that is a problem. I'm going to lose my dude. But that's going to be fine. That's gonna be you fine. can just rescue him. I can. That's not that easy. It's easier said than done. Okay. But yeah, I'm going to do the same Pretty thing. Dramatic. I'm going to do... Oh, but that changes it because then it's water here, but that's fine. I'm going to do this. Yeah. And I'm just going to grab a water and two... two uh, yeah. Uh, steel. I'm not going to use the gold for the machine. Yep. And then I am going to play this. Yes. Three steel for a medium machine. Which one do you want? Mm, because now we're at the end of the game pretty soon, so I'm just gonna grab the one that gives me the most points. Nice. Point. And then I am gonna spend take this one. Yeah. To grab the one that makes the these not be negative points. Aww. You're fairly sure that you can't save him. It's only two points different, so oh, yeah. it's basically safer. Yeah. Could you refill that? Yes, I can. Three whistles? Are you crazy? And at the end of the turn, if you have eight or more resources, you get two points. 
why are those so bad? I feel like they've been better when I haven't gone for those. <laughs> no, they've helped me. I didn't help you quite a bit. Not that one, but it's eight points, so it's okay. Yes, now it's your turn. Yeah. So I have to take in. Yeah. Could you give me the lost airship, please? The lost airship. That's like the lost airbender only. <laughs> Almost. That sounds so much more lame. The lost airship. Okay, um, I want to start building. I want to build over here and over here. Uh huh. And that will give me two gold. Yeah, and you will get one, two, three, four, five, six, seven points. Seven. We'll take a ten and throw away three. Yeah. Then I will spend one gold, or should I spend both? Two. You need to also spend uh, to move. You have to spend waters to do. Oh yeah, of course. I'm spending both of them. So you're doing three bill actions. Yep. Yeah. I think I will just take it from here. Because there's coming another water right now. It's going on top. Yay. Um doing that yeah so you get a free build which is pretty neat cool and, and then you get the water comes and takes my dude away can you place the water over here that's yeah, really nice but now I, I will I'm just like wondering if there's something that I'm missing I don't think you need to get those oh, 10 yeah, points to so take points. that and that also a small machine what I was thinking about I will get this double pointer uh-huh and remember the water now Remember the water and there's just oh no, there's just two water left. Yeah, or three more dudes if we get to uh, move them. Oh, yeah So uh, you're done. I am done So now it's me and I'm gonna take in. Yeah, it's gonna take in this and I'm gonna spend two water to do three builds And I am gonna build this over here for two points. Yep. And I'm then gonna build this over there for one, two, three, four points. That's seven points. Seven total. Isn't that fine? Yep. Yeah. Do you have three points? Uh, yes, I do. So I get a ten, and then I am gonna spend this. Yep, yeah, that sounds nice. Move him up here. That's very good. And I am gonna spend my goal nice. to move him up here. So good. And I'm gonna place this over here. Nice. We get 12 points and then we that is too many just points. go up here in the 10 point category good for you boom yeah it is actually good for me that was a Bad 30 point me. move and have i played mm. a card no one i don't want to play a card do you want to play a ribbon or i have already done that oh yeah you I, uh, I placed one up there so now it's only one more dude mm, yeah so when you move him it's gonna end the game oh it is yes Oh, we don't need to fill it with water. Uh, and you get the new water. Oh, yeah. So he's on the verge of... Hmm. I can build now. Is that the best thing to do? Then you get one more turn. That means that you... Will I can't really do anything on the last turn. Mm, yeah. That means that you're going to lose at least four points. That is good for me. Oh yeah, because of this, that is true. Is that the best thing? Hmm. I'm just plotting. I didn't really get a lot of use of this, but I wouldn't have gone for these if it wasn't for it. That is true. Hmm. And I get a free build now, so that means that I can end it this turn. But then I have two more of these that I can't really use. But I guess it's fine. But I have five negative points here. And I can't really move them. Nope. If there were only gold on this, no, he would go down there anyway. Okay, well, I think that is the best just to finish it now mm -hmm. so that you can't do anything finish. else. I, yeah, I think that is the best thing to do. Mm -hmm. I'm not entirely sure though. 
I think that I will place this here. Mm -hmm. That is one. So you are resetting three, basically. Four, yeah, I am. Or doing the forge action, which is cool, basically. I get four points. One, two, three, four. Yep. Uh, plus eight. That's 12. And I use this to build it. Because we don't have any water yet. Yeah. 12, where is my tens? And I I can just get a coal, for example. Mm -hmm. I guess you're going to spend that gold. Yeah, I want to move your to dude do up that. there and he's going to end up over here. And That's cool. And then we're placing another water. And the game is over. It is. I'm just going to get my last turn, which is basically, uh, let's see, can you turn your board over to see just oh, uh, yeah, how many resources I need to get to point? I don't need these. If oh. there's any way. Yeah, I'm basically just going to move, place him here, I'm guessing. Like that, because I get for every four resources. Four, four, yeah. Yeah, so this doesn't really matter, so I'm just throwing it away. So I only get three resources for that action. But if I instead do this, I get four more resources and two more points. Nice. So I'm gonna get a five. Yeah, or but you're going to get four as well. I reckon. Oh, yeah. So I'm gonna get six in total. Six points there. I don't, I can't exchange that. And then one of each. There you go. Six. What is the last one? Water. So, yeah, this just goes out. Oh no, I'm gonna get a point for that. Yeah. Yay. So that was a decent last action. Yeah, it was. But I think you sh could have done something better. I got two, three points at least. Mm. So yeah, yep. that is the end of this game. So let's do the final scoring then. Yeah. So should we just, I'm just going to use uh, board game stats. Yeah, do that. Instead of actually counting up all of these, because that's going to take a lot more time. So let's see. Let's start just with uh, the points on the tower. On this one, yeah. Yeah, you got 29 plus 15, 29 plus 15, 30 plus 14, that is 44, 48, mm. 48. And yeah. then you have negative five. Yep, I do. And then you have how much on the machines? No, the upgrades. 16 plus six, 22. 22. And then you have... Here? No, no. The, the, uh, the end, you don't have anyone for that? For this? Mm, I have one. So no points then. Wait, huh? Yeah. No. Oh. Oh yeah, it's every two. Yeah. But I have these two as well. Oh, so that's two points. And how many, <laughs> points, like, how many points do you have there? Um, uh, let's see. 10, 20, 30, 40, 58. 58. That's a lot less than I got last time on this point. Okay. So I have here... 20 plus 18, which is 38, 46, 52, 53. Yeah. How much did you have? 48. 48 so it's almost think, the yeah. same. Mm -hmm. How? Because you have 15 here and I have 14. How do I have almost the same as you? So that's 19. You can count again. So it's 20. And this is 18, so that's 38. Yeah. And then this is 46. Mm -hmm. And then this is 52, 53. Yeah. And you have 15, 19, 39, 48. It's correct. Mm. So it just, I felt like I would have more than you mm -hmm. here than I had. And then no negatives. And I have eight points on those. Yep. And then basically I have two points here, three, and for every two cards, so I have four points. Yeah. That's four points, and then the card, I have 10, 20, 40, 50, 60, 70, 84. Oh, that's a lot. Nice. Okay. So, you got 125. 
And I yep. got 149. Nice. So it happened again. I won on a playthrough. It's amazing. Yay. It feels good. I felt like this was very good. Oh yeah, it was and so good. And with a trophy good. room, like you, it's kind of like a gamble because you don't yeah. know if, you, but most of these are good in some way or another. Yeah. So and also the then I had the combination with also using a card, so playing a card and one of those almost every turn was oh, pretty yeah. good. Oh yeah, I thought that was super powerful. I thought that was really good. Mm hmm. I don't think we have played it the wrong. Because, oh, because uh, that basically, if you get it early in the game, which is possible to get, mm -hmm. you are guaranteed to get one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. You're not guaranteed. Yeah, you're playing badly if you're getting way fewer, though. Okay, that so is that is Whistle Mountain. Let's talk a bit about this yeah. game. Let's first just talk about the graphic design of this game, how the game looks. I... The artwork and the components, yeah. as we used to call it, yeah. Uh, this is my greatest problem with the game, mm -hmm. uh, comes right up now. First of all, the airships are super cool, but they block my view. So mm -hmm. it happens, especially when we play with more than two yeah, players. Yeah, two players worked fine. Yeah, it was nice. Sitting but... at the same side of the table, yes. that is. Uh, we were lifting them and asking each other where what's underneath mm -hmm. this and also it's very easy to like uh, push your pieces a little bit around yes. so they fall because there's nothing to stop them under this water or down here yeah so it would have I mean, been you're not nice. gonna do this like no, you're not that bad but it's it's easy to move it around I agree. it would have been really easy to just have this first water to be a thicker layer so uh -huh. that it has like a bottom um so that is my biggest flaw of this game actually it would have been like it, it would have been a more complex piece because you would have needed to have this uh as a bumper up here so you have to have it a double piece so it would have been a more complex piece to make but i i don't i don't know why because it's, it's a lot of moving pieces here yeah uh, and that's like it wasn't a big problem now but it's a lot, when more people are moving around it's a bigger problem but it's and, yeah it's it's clear to me that they have chosen aesthetics over gameplay uh with these because they look super cool but these mm -hmm. could have been cardboard tokens or yeah. at least much flatter uh wooden pieces and it would have worked much better with seeing what every machine does yeah and it is actually a problem like because when you are more players more of these are out on the table and mm. if this is there i have no idea no way of seeing what this piece does like I have to move them around, I have to sit and do this. And it's hard because I'm sitting trying to visualize what I want to do yeah. and it's hard to do that because it wasn't a problem now because we were playing two players sitting at the same side. Mm. Another thing which I'm usually a fan of in games is where the board has spaces for everything. Yeah. But in this game, those spaces block the view. So the reason we have them over here, this is supposed to be here. Now if I sit, I have to look over here to be able to see what this does. I have cheated a little bit here today. This was to be so Supposed, supposed to be, to be there. there. Oh yeah. So why is that? Why isn't it there? Because if somebody is. Oh on yeah, but that, it's. It, but then. But, it, so yeah. so the problem here is that this is gonna block for somebody when you sit around a table. It's gonna block, and and it doesn't block the whole thing. But if I sit here now, I do not know what that middle piece does. No. Uh, and also these are supposed to be on top of here. And I like the thought of that. But yeah, I but, don't like but it. if somebody sits here now. They're not gonna see the first row mm. without doing that. And I don't like playing a game where I have to sit and, and do all of this to be able to see things. I wanna sit down, I wanna see things. So there's a good idea of that, mm. but it just does not work. I and mean, then it's so much better just have this on the side and, and be able to see the game. In some games, there are like maybe two or three elements that is supposed to be on the board that uh -huh. you have to take aside. There, this is not the only game that this is a problem with, but it's so much in this game that mm -hmm. blocks our view. And especially with these very big airships, that that's nice. my big, big, biggest problem. They're nice, but they're, they're very they're, nice. But so yeah, but the artwork is good. I think like oh, the yeah. artwork is clear, mm. uh, which makes it it, it it manages to look nice, even though it's very simple mm. artwork. It's just like this is a machine. Yeah, it's just a metal plating with the thing on it, which yes. it makes it, it 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 works really well. That that part of the game. So mm. I like the artwork like the graphic design of these yeah. they make it look not boring even though it is actually a quite boring looking game mm -hmm. like this is very boring this looks like old cards mm -hmm. and this is not very like it's not uh, 
not something I was like, oh, this is amazing artwork. But it looks nice because mm. they managed somehow to make it look good anyways. And this moving up or like this building mm. thing looks really neat and will be something that people, if they walk past you at a convention, I don't know if you remember those, but they would move past and say like, oh, this looks nice because of that. Uh, some things I do like about yeah. the graphics is this. I really think this is cool mm -hmm. and not because it needed to be there, but freeing up sp space on the board yes. uh, and having these docks instead of uh, worker placement yeah. spaces are really nice. Since you need to have this on the board, it's important yeah. to have the And also because on there the is uh, different uh, sizes on uh -huh. the uh, player pieces as well. I also really like the player reference here, just all, both the scoring and also very nice and uh, uh, usable, like, uh, what do you call it? Play, player, play, play, game. Player. Playability? Player aid. Player aid. Yes. I didn't know, know what word you were Player looking for. Player aid. I really like this. This is super usable. And also, if there's some some kind of symbols that you don't understand, there is very neatly explained in the rule books. All the symbols are very accessible, and mm -hmm. all the cards are explained, and all the awards and stuff. So I'm very happy about that. Yeah. Uh, this is a pretty straightforward game. Like yeah. it's not a very complex game at all. The rule book is, is long because it has a reference for everything, which mm. is something I like. Mm. Uh, every single tile, every single card is explained yes. in there, which is amazing. You don't feel stupid. No. And you don't feel like, oh, I should have understood this mm. because this is the only card you don't explain. So, but the rules is basically like seven pages and half of those pages are pictures and examples. So it's a very simple game. As you have seen, you're basically gathering resources to get these to build them, to build them in the best way possible so that you can promote your workers to stand in this very nice looking tower for the rest of their lives. Yay. And look at the water flooding all of their friends. So <laughs> uh, again, the theme doesn't exist there, yes. so I'm not going to spend any more time on that. Uh, so it's a very simple game, uh, but there are, it feels like there are some different strategies. Mm. But the different strategies you go for really depends on, like, because everybody has to build scaffolds. You have to build the machines. You have to do that. I feel like to, you can't, no, I'm not going to build any machines because those gives you loads of points. Mm. If you don't have any special powers, and that is where I feel like the game is going to differentiate. It's because of these powers, because mm. of the upgrades, that is how you are going to change up how you play. Mm. Uh, and that is going to, change the game from, from time to time and also like in, to, to answer your question like is there different strategies here I feel like yes and no is the answer because there the strategy is to get as many points as possible and to get as many points as possible like it's it's obviously better to get 10 points than to get one yeah but if the, the if the option is to get negative five or one one is obviously better mm. so for you for example you've got loads down here and I got very many up here, but we ended up almost at the same mm -hmm. amount of points in, in this. So that is interesting, is that like the core gameplay is much the same. Yeah. Like you need to do a lot of things to make the game flow, but the game also changes a bit. What do you think? Mm. Yeah, I think uh, unless you get that uh, winner's circle where, no, sorry, the lifeboat, yeah. where all of these are basically serial, yeah. you are your main goal is save your guys from the water mm -hmm. and get them as high as possible yeah um yeah possibly before the others that you can claim the uh award Trophies. trophy <laughs> and that's there so that is that is my main goal no matter what in this mm -hmm. game um but i feel like there is some times where you have no desire to go for any cards there's been many times that i haven't had any upgrades at all mm -hmm. there's sometimes that i build barely enough scaffolding that i can just put a machine down there yep. because that is my goal mm -hmm. and there's times where i build very few machines and just like sploosh the table with a lot of scaffolds mm -hmm. so i feel like there is different ways to roam kind of yeah, yeah, yeah. if that makes sense absolutely but it really feels like a, a race oh yeah like it's a race to get your workers out a yes. race to go up to the top so uh, what do you feel about that i feel like the game is rushing me kind of mm -hmm. a bit so you're going through the motions because you know what is most important to you yep. uh, get machines get scaffolding get resources go up on this it's 
not a track, but <laughs> yeah. The tower. Um, so in many cases, I really go want to go for one of those upgrades, mm -hmm. but I don't have the time for that because yep. I see that you have the opportunity to build a building next mm -hmm. turn. So if I don't rush it, then you will do it. And yep. then my people will go in the water and have a nice spa day. Have a nice spa day. A nice spa day, yeah. absolutely. So I agree with you. I feel like it's... a. Uh, but it's also meant not to be a very long game. Like yeah, yeah, it's not absolutely. meant to be a game where you build a super power like most engine builders because it has some engine building mm. elements with especially with the upgrades. So yeah. the cards are more one-time abilities. It's not meant to be like you build up, 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 and you go that engine all and all and all. Yeah, it's yeah. kind of like getting just enough and uh, just enough of this. But I'm like. I have a problem seeing you will have to get really specific cards, really specific things to end up with six of these. Oh yeah, I had the technician now. That yeah. basically means that I should go for this. Uh -huh. We were in a tricky spot now. We had no whistles. Yes. So that made those really hard to go for. Yeah. It would have looked differently if I had a lot of whistles and I could have used those abilities. Mm -hmm. Then I would have bought those. Um, but yeah, I, I don't know. My, my brain melted. Where was I going with my thought? I don't know. Getting six is hard. Yes. Is what my, my point was. So it is a race, but it is also like it, it's the work replacement part yeah. of the game, which is really neat. You both have the, these are kind of like normal work replacement game, uh, work replacement, but this is what makes this different. Oh yeah. Uh, because you have that placement where you can place on top of one and you activate that and everything adjacent. You want to place around, you can block some... Oh, if there's a good spot, you can block it by building a mm. scaffolding. Yes. It's a very good example in this ramp oh, scramble yeah, I, of a, I, of I a board. I just mix it around. And I like that worker placement mechanism. What do you think? I agree. And I think Luke Laurie, he's made uh, this mechanism before that mm -hmm. you place one on one worker and you take them all back. Yeah. And this is a different like touch on that. And yeah. I think I think it really works. I really like that you can take in your workers before you have to to mm -hmm. do this uh, forge action. Yeah. And I also like that you have different worker pieces yes. so that they have different sizes so they fit. You can be a little creative with your options on this board. And I also like the fact that it uh Kind of like you can do the it's better two different actions do the work replacement or do the forge action yeah. like the reset here is more of me opening the board to you yeah uh, like for example dwelling some other whale where we just played it uh, depended on how many i just placed depending on how good the take back action mm -hmm. is yeah. here it's going to be it doesn't matter how many i place it matters mm -hmm. what i can do yes. when i take them back so i can place one zero two like it yes. isn't that change so that changes up also how that mechanism works and I really enjoy the, the, the work that Luke Laurie and Scott Caputo have done here mm. to make a very different, uh, like it works very well together. I like yeah. the, the way that you make a fluid worker placement spots and make this, um, uh, this map basically change of how the worker placement spots work, change of how the worker placement is. And that makes it for a, a unique game for me. Yeah, I like the interaction here as well. There's yeah. loads of interaction on the worker spaces because sometimes it will be a new machine and you see like, oh, that is a good space to mm -hmm. put it. And the the boards open up at different places. So maybe you have an advantage and it opens up right when you can put it there. Mm -hmm. And just, just taking advantage of that and also squeezing in so that your building also covers my workers yep. so that you save me as well. I think that is nice. Absolutely. So there is some luck in the game. Yeah. Um, but again, I'm going to say something strange. It doesn't bother me. I think Luke Laurie said, because somebody said like doing so other way, like 80% genius and 20% luck. Yeah. And I think Luke Laurie, if I'm, I'm sorry if I misquote you and I don't remember the exact quote, but he said like that is the perfect amount for me of luck mm. in a game. Like he enjoys games where there are some variabilities, something that, oh, that was very lucky. I'm not sure if everything here is like completely balanced. Mm. Like for example, this seems very good oh, to be able to just get really like good. six, seven of these trophies. Again, I got to play every single one except for one and I even mm. got more from these and yeah. from this. So some things feels better than other things, but it ha it's not like I don't feel like the player who won got like super lucky you also got to play mm. play well yeah because there are games we enjoy I'm gonna again say like the terraforming Mars which mm. has a lot of luck in the drawing which most of the time don't bother me and usually don't bother you um so I don't mind the luck here but there is luck I don't feel the luck here is no. very big because it's not like oh you got to build that one 
I can also use it. Yeah. So I feel like the luck is more if some of these comes up at the right moment when you need it and you have the resources and also the cards. But those, it's not actually that much luck. No, I don't bother in this game. I, I the, the only thing was the whistles right now, but that was the only problem. And that wasn't luck. That was just like the game being feeling different for yeah, us now absolutely. because we didn't have a lot of whistles and that changed it up. And it was not like I was getting oh, a lot of no, whistles no. and you no, were not. No, no problem. But I feel like... Um, but most of the uh, trophies you can use for something yeah. and most of the uh, cards, cards you can yes. use for something mm -hmm. and if you don't use them for something they're worth points at the end of the game yeah. that's fine and here it seems like they've tried to balance it out with mm -hmm. the points and i have not done the math there that i think they, i think look laurie and scott a bit of i think they have done that. it uh, themselves yeah so i feel like when i think that a piece the a machine here is very powerful mm -hmm. do i want it available for the other players that is interesting yeah i see that oh it has a higher point count uh -huh. okay is it worth it for me then to make it available so yeah. it nets me more points so that is really interesting so should we do some final thoughts yeah you can start okay so this was again the first time i played and i didn't fall in love with it and uh, i don't know why like many games this year has been that way i just think because i didn't know what to expect because mm. i didn't know really anything about this game other than seeing pictures of it um which is most of the time the way i like to go into games because then i will try to have a fresh not be like hyped for a game but always there is some hype we can talk about that later in a topic of rambling it's called hype but <laughs> this is a, a very neat game it has these graphical issues but they're very easy to get around most of them just take these out the board take these off the board the only problem is the actual placement mm. of that but that doesn't it doesn't take away from the enjoyment of the game it bothers it irritates me a bit when we play but not much the luck isn't horrible i have fun playing it which is mm. the most important thing i have not played a game that does this in that interesting way mm. i'm a bit unsure if it's a game i want to play many times in a row because it is kind of like rinse and repeat filming mm. where you need to get scaffolds you need to get a machine you need to try to get it as fast as high as possible while saving them so you're basically that is the main goal every time you play so it will feel different because of the starting abilities it will feel different because of that but it is fun to play mm. it is one of those games like when we play as many games as we do, I always appreciate something unique yeah. when it works. I always appreciate it when somebody takes a... Like, this is a worker placement game. It is, like, at its core, it's a worker placement game, but it is twisted around. Mm -hmm. Like, doing something new with it, and that is something I really appreciate. So, I have fun playing the game. I enjoy many of the things. I enjoy the worker placement spots. I enjoy the ever-changing uh, worker placement area where there are many different actions you can do like the actions are kind of the same like change something into something else but again we talked about this in the merg video yeah. that many many euro games like most euro games are basically get resources exchange them for something else and exchange them for points yeah so to be able to do that in an interesting way and i feel like they've done here it's a pretty light game uh like it's a medium light game i the rules are very simple i think i could have played this again it's almost like next step mm. so it's a bit light but it's fun for the way it is and when you play it i think now we spent like a bit more than an hour mm. i think that's a nice nice time frame mm. for it so i'm gonna give it an eight i like the oh, game quite nice. a bit i want to keep it in the collection i think it is a lot of fun i am happy that we have played it and i i want to play it again so that is uh, my final thoughts let's do yours now yeah i'm not going to rumble that much because you basically done a little bit of the rambling for me um i agree with everything you said okay I... thank you so much for watching <laughs> i'm johannes absolutely well. oh, help me okay but uh i'm going to give luke laurie uh the same rating as he got for his other game dwellings of elder whale that we uh did a review not that long ago. Yep. So it's a seven. It's a good game. So what about Scott Caputo? What's he he's gonna get? Uh, he's also no. He's gonna get a five. He's gonna ah. get a ten, and then it's gonna be a seven point six. Yeah, no seven. It's a good oh, game. Okay, so yeah. you like it, like it, but it's not amazing. Um, nice. as you said, the graphic designs are the biggest problem with the mm -hmm. game, but I don't deduct the game many points for that. So gameplay wise i think it's good I, th I think it's solid okay so you are a strict person now but that's just how it's gonna be what let's play board games and have fun that's yeah. the end of another playthrough and review we hope you enjoyed it please let us know in the comments please subscribe if you haven't done so already thank yes. you so much for watching i'm johannes I'm Cinema. and you've been watching board gaming ramblings and bye bye